everyone, I'm Alicia Anderson and welcome to the Fort Report. Today on Fort Report, we are going to talk about Grease, my favorite musical of all time, with John Travolta and Olivia Newton-John and all of those great songs. Like, you're the one that I want, you are the one I want, hoo hoo hoo, honey, the one no. that I want, you are the one. Oh, I see. Well, cooking grease can cause sewer pipes to clog, so we should probably find out how to properly dispose of it. What people should do is they should let their um, grease or their cooking oil cool down to room temperature, and if it's cooking oil, the best thing they can do is actually put it back in the original container, and then they can seal that up. And then what we would prefer they do is to take it to our ECC, our Environmental Collection Center, and then uh, turn that in and that will be used to create biofuel. Uh, with grease, they can also do a similar thing. They can scrape that off, put that in any kind of a container, preferably a glass container or something with some sort of a screw top lid, and then also recycle that as well. If for some reason they're not able to recycle either of these and bring it to the ECC, they can actually put it in their trash. If you put cooking oil or grease down the drain, it will get hardened and clog your pipes. When your drain is clogged, the sewer water could back up into your home, your shower, and toilet. Our sewer pipes are actually gravity fed and they're not under pressure. So the water actually just trickles down. So because of that, it doesn't move very fast and so it allows buildups to easily occur. So as that uh, cooking oil and grease hardens as it gets cold, it can actually back up and slowly cause a huge clog. And if that clogs on your side of the property, that'll be something that you will have to pay to take care of. If it's on the city side, then that's something that we would have to come in and fix as well. We're talking possibly having to block off a road, the inconvenience to you. Needless to say, it costs the city money as well, which kind of back in kind of comes back to the consumer, so it's just really better if we just properly dispose of cooking oil and grease. The second annual Holiday Grease Roundup is from November 30th through December 11th. Various cities throughout DFW are having different events. Uh, we ourselves, since we have the Environmental Collection Center, it's going to be open during its normal hours during that time. Uh, but it's just again, just to kind of highlight that as we're cooking, as we're creating all this grease, it's really best that we don't send it down the drain. Let's do something positive with it and recycle it and then have it used for biofuels. So don't pour your Thanksgiving grease down the drain. Visit the Cease the Grease website to learn more. Here's a look at other events happening in and around Fort Worth in the next few weeks. For a listing of more events and city meetings, you always can check the calendar at the city's website.